Before direct supply contracts, the relationship was always against each other. If one year the prices are way down, well, what do you do? Do you stick with that or do you change your policy? Or You know, they love the dry and they can handle the wet and the cold. Merinos are you know, the breed of sheep that can handle that the best. So what is it about the sheep that makes them want to come here? Is it just protection? I think it's a natural protection. Uh, they're just looking for the best feed. This country that we're on is actually ideal for Merino sheep. When I first started farming, we didn't even know the people who bought the wool in New Zealand, let alone where it went. It's, a, it's such a good product and you actually believe in it. Uh, the world merino numbers are at historic low. Well, went back to about sort of the 1940s. I think it's got there's a very big future. It's a pride all the way down the line. Yeah. I'm Alistair Campbell. I'm Grant Allen. I'm Amanda Murray. I'm Graham. This is my wife Kelly. I'm Bev. John Phillipson. I'm Hamish. I'm Chid Murray. And I'm, I'm a Merino wool farmer.